The cleanup continued into the mid-morning. Only sand, sawdust and scorch marks left as a testament to this terrifying event. The cause of this blaze is now under investigation. Reports suggesting that the truck may have had a mechanical fault. Lily Cardis, Nine News. Last year, the Little Ripper performed the world's first drone ocean rescue at Lennox Head. Now the team is working towards bringing this life-saving technology to water rescues across inland Australia. Police initially refused Mr Fleetner bail when he was arrested, but today at Orange Local Court, a magistrate chose not to keep him behind bars, releasing him on strict conditions. Inflows at Burrindong Dam are at an all-time low. Currently at 9% capacity, it's expected to be at 5% by the end of summer. And with the current drought conditions across the state, water management will be a tipping point in the upcoming election. Regional cities in the state's central west are hotspots for tackling the scourge of ice. Drug use bringing a rise in domestic violence, assault and property crime. Police on the beat are doing the best that they can, but say everyone has a role to play when it comes to tackling drug dealers. The upgrade and restrictions mean residents will only be allowed to have five-minute showers and won't be allowed to water their lawns at all. While Chifley Police District can't comment directly on resourcing matters, they say that businesses can implement simple measures to help deter criminals.